Good afternoon, everyone. We are so excited to have everyone here today. Um, my name is Cordera Harper, and I am the Tri-M Chapter Advisor here at Cleveland High School, as well as a core director here. And I am so excited about our new Tri-M Music Honor Society. At this time, I would like to welcome our esteemed guest, Dr. Joseph Hansen. I would like to also welcome our teachers, staff, administration, and everyone who came out to, 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 to this event this afternoon. We will now at this time have our chapter president, Mr. Storm Adams, to join us. Ladies, gentlemen, and fellow students, we welcome you to this important occasion. Today, we will formally induct a number of students who have met the necessary Tri-M criteria and have accepted invitations to become active members of the Tri-M Music Honor Society. At this time, to start off the ceremony, we will play a performance by Jacob Domain, E2 Number 1, uh, Portraits in Rhythm. Our second performance is uh, Allegretto uh, Grazios by Johannes Brahms, performed by Jamie Hill. Hi, my name is Jamie Lee Hill, and I will be playing the clarinet sonata Allegretto Grazioso in F minor by Johannes Brahms.
At this time, I wish to introduce the student officers of our chapter. Jamie Hill is the vice president. Elizabeth Terrio is the secretary. Emma Hunt is the treasurer. And Crystal Robertson is the historian. I will now ask Emma Hunt, our chapter treasurer, to present the candidates for student membership. These music students have been carefully selected on the basis of scholarship, character, leadership, and service. Scholarship represents scholastic achievement and open-mindedness towards knowledge and truth. Character em em emphasizes a devotion to high ideals and recognizes no barriers between people of diverse backgrounds. Leadership guides us to greater undertakings and service encourages assistance and kindness to others. We will now describe the meaning of the name Triton for the candidates for student membership. The name Triton was derived from the original name of our honor society, Modern Music Masters. The vice president and secretary will speak of the first letter M, which signifies modern. That which is new in any age is called modern. It is only in looking back that descriptions such as old, classical, or romantic are given to those art forms that had formerly been accepted as modern. Let us remember that we should study the past to effectively plan our future. This is a youth organization, and with each succeeding year, its membership will be made up of young people such as you. Therefore, our honor society will never grow old, but will be eternally modern. The second letter M signifies music. The treasurer and historian will explain this second symbol. According to the Random House Dictionary of the English Language, music is the art of sound that expresses ideas and emotions in significant forms through elements of rhythm, melody, harmony, and color. Music was present even before there was written language, and from then, that time to present, it has been a source of communication. Music is the universal language. The third letter M signifies masters. In the art field, the custom has been to give the title of master to those who have achieved a high degree of proficiency. We have met the criteria as a Tri-M candidate for student membership. As masters, you now have increased your opportunities to serve your school and community. A member of the Tri-M Music Honor Society is one who sets a good example, is always willing to assist those students who are striving to better themselves in the music department and always remembers that real honor brings responsibility. May you accept this honor of membership and the responsibility that is now vested in you and wear your pen emblem with pride. Please explain the meaning of the Tri-M membership emblem. The Tri-M emblem was designed to symbolize the function and purpose of the honor society. The music staff, the lyre, and the scroll represent the members' proficiency and service in the field of music. The triplet figure in the form of an M symbolizes the three M's in the name Modern Music Masters, from which the society's name was derived. I will now recite the Tri-M Music Honor Society Pledge. We, the members of the Cleveland High School Music Department, in order to foster a great, greater continued interest and a desire for excellence in music performance, to, encut, to encourage appreciation and awareness in listening to music, to promote wider opportunities for sharing joy through music, both within our school and within our community, to advance the spirit of good music and music, musical knowledge, and to enhance the reputation of our school. As a center for music, musical enrichment, accept the honor now granted to us. The following candidates for student membership have qualified to become new members of the Tri-M Honor Society. Storm Adams, Miranda Lewis, Jamie Hill, Jacob Domain, Emma Hunt, Elizabeth Terrio, Crystal Robertson. 
I now officially congratulate and welcome you as new members of Chapter 8806 of the Tri-M Music Honor Society. May you remember this occasion and strive to live up to the aims and ideals of this organization. We will now hear a performance of America the Beautiful uh, performed by Crystal Robertson. Oh, beautiful for spacious skies, for amber waves of grain, for purple mountain majesties above the fruited plain. America, America, God shed His grace on Pleasure to read the congratulatory message from the Tri-M Music Honor Society National Leadership to the new members of Chapter 8806. Dear inductees, congratulations on your induction into the Tri-M Music Honor Society. Your nomination for membership is based on your musicianship, academic qualification, and demonstrated leadership. You may take great pride in this achievement which unites you with thousands of other student members throughout the world. As you were instructed during the presentation ceremony, we should study the past to effectively prepare for our future. With that thought in mind, you are now in a unique position of being able to pass on the torch of your musical knowledge to colleagues and future beneficiaries of musical arts. May you wear Trium with pride and dignity as you continue to demonstrate the value of music in your life and share your gift with your school and community. Welcome to the Triumph family. At this time, I would like to call on President Storm Adams. To welcome our honorable guest speaker today, Dr. Joseph Hansen. Dr. Joseph Hansen is Assistant Professor and Coordinator of Music Education at the University of Memphis, where he oversees bachelor's, master's, and doctoral programs in music education. Previously, he taught at the University of Massachusetts, Boston, and at the University of Rochester, 
as well as in public schools in the state of Maryland. Dr. Hansen is a specialist in entrepreneurial thinking applied to music, teaching, and learning. From 2016 to 2020, he served as president of the Society for Arts Entre Entrepreneurship Education, as well as an editorial board member and reviewer for various scholarly journals in music and entrepreneurship. Dr. Hansen has led ensembles and performance at the Kennedy Center and Rock and Roll Hall of Fame, and his writing has been featured in a variety of leading periodicals, including the Journal of Research in Music Education, International Journal of Music Education, and College Music Symposium. At this time, I present to some and introduce to others Dr. Joseph Hansen from the University of Memphis. Thank you very much, Storm. And can everybody hear me okay? Wonderful. Thank you. Students, guests, it is an honor to join you today on this exciting and momentous occasion as you formally establish Cleveland High School's chapter of the Tri-M Music Honor Society and celebrate your inaugural inductees. Tri-M is the only truly national level honor society for student musicians in the United States. So being inducted is a tremendous achievement, recognizing both academic and musical accomplishment and representing the joy of a musical life and the promise to serve others through it. So in short, it is a very big deal. To the students being honored today, we celebrate your artistry and scholarship we are inspired by your dedication and leadership. And in this crazy time in which we're living, we are strengthened by your passion for music and performing and your commitment to help heal the world with your rhythms, melodies, and harmonies. The world needs more musicians. You have discovered what a wise music teacher once told me, music is a chocolate chip in the cookie of life. There's just something magical about music. And once you have it in you, no one can ever take it away. It can never be taken away. So today is your day, Tri-M inductees. Enjoy this moment, savor every message of congratulations because tomorrow the real work begins. As the old saying goes, with great power comes great responsibility. Becoming a member of Tri-M isn't just an achievement, it's a challenge. A challenge of leadership, of advocacy, and service to others. You can't turn back now. You're the inaugural class. Will you rise to the challenge that has been set before you? You can and you must. Allow me to give you a few things to think about as you prepare for this journey ahead. Number one, music is important because it is music. As Tri-M members, you must become staunch advocates for music education so that all children have opportunities to create magical moments through music. Too often, we hear people justify music based on its external benefits. It makes you more responsible. It raises your test scores. It opens you up to scholarships for college. Now make mo no mistake, those are positive outcomes, but music is a unique human experience and its unique quality cannot be replicated through the study of any other discipline. You've all had those magical moments with music that are hard to put into words those moments, that unspoken sense of satisfaction. That's the true value of music, not increased test scores. If school music is to survive and thrive, as it has for decades, its value must stand on its own merits. So as advocates for music education, you might talk about those external benefits, if it makes sense, but your core belief should never waver. Music is worth studying because it is music. Number two, believe in yourself. As Tri-M members, you will serve as role models to others. And it takes self-confidence. 
It may sound strange, but I recommend you fake it till you make it. Now, I don't mean to suggest that you start lying to people, but no matter what circumstance you find yourself in, meeting a new group of people, learning a new skill, playing or singing a solo, enter that situation with your chin up, stand tall and believe in yourself, even if you have no idea what to expect. Don't you dare let someone else undermine your confidence or steal your dreams. Those other people don't have the final say. There's a story about a businessman who made some bad deals. He was so deep in debt that bankruptcy seemed inevitable. He sat on a park bench wondering how he could survive when all of a sudden an old man walked up. I see there's something troubling you, the old man said. After hearing about the businessman's troubles, the old man wrote him a check right on the spot. Take this money, meet me back here in one year and you can pay me back. The businessman looked down and saw in his hand a check for $500,000 signed by John D. Rockefeller, one of the wealthiest men in the world. But instead of cashing that check, the businessman took it home and stored it away in his safe. Just knowing that check was there gave him new confidence that he could find a way. With his renewed belief in himself, he went about renegotiating deals, paying down his debts, and making some big sales. One year later, he returned to the park with the uncashed check, and at the appointed time, the old man appeared. But just as the businessman approached the old man to return the check to him, a nurse came running up and grabbed the old man. Oh, I'm so glad I caught him, she said. He keeps escaping from the mental hospital and telling people he's John D. Rockefeller. You see, none of this was true. But the businessman realized that it wasn't the money that turned his life around. It was his restored self-confidence. So what about you? What kind of down payments do you have locked up in your safe? If you expect little, you're going to receive little. If you expect favor and promotion, big things, then you'll see new levels of success. So what are you expecting? Big things, little things, nothing at all? The third thing I want you to think about, tri -M inductees, is that you should live to serve others. Giving back through service is one of your most important responsibilities as a tri -M member. The simple fact is, if you want to live a blessed life, you have to serve others. Not every once in a while, but as part of your lifestyle. Somebody out there needs what you have to offer. There's a baby being born this very day that will need wisdom, kindness, and ingenuity from you. Not from somebody like you. They can only receive it from you. Maybe you'll end up being their teacher, their doctor, their lawyer, or their favorite musician. You haven't met them yet, but that day is coming. The point is, the seeds of greatness you have within you will not grow unless you give them away. So just quietly look for ways to be an asset to someone else. Small acts of kindness have huge implications, and they always come back to you. So, tri -M inductees, we celebrate you today, but remember, today is a call to action. Your future is too bright to waste a single moment. Remember that music is important because it is music, a truly unique human experience. Remember to believe in yourself as you will be serving as a role model to others and they will be watching. And remember that the secret to good living is to live to serve others. I'm honored and humbled to share this moment with you, the next generation of difference makers in music, and I can't wait to see all of the good you will do in the world. So congratulations. Thank you, Dr. Joseph Hansen. That was great words. Thank you so much. Um,